All right, so here we have the Moving Man Simulation Constant Speed Motion Lab. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on this link, open up the FET simulation, and when you do, it'll look like this. So click the play symbol, and then you're going to choose one of these options. I'm just going to run the Chirp J browser compatible version, so that it will take a little bit to load. So I'll just wait for that. All right, starting up. All right, so here's our simulation. Here's where you're gonna click if you wanna see the graphs, which is what we will want to do. But first, we are going to Click reset all. Well, we don't have to do that. We, we can if we want to. Sure, but it already is reset. All right, set the assigned velocity. Check the table below. So our first velocity is going to be one meter per second. So we go over here. We're going to make this one. You can either slide this over or it's just easier just to type one. All right, and then you can see we're going to we're going to press start and then stop the man before he hits the wall. So we'll come over here, play. There he goes. He is walking. Very exciting. <laughs> All right, we're going to stop him. There we go. All right, so if we click on charts. Let's try that again. I guess we have to. You can watch him walk here, but that's not as much fun as the graphs, so I'm going to do it again. Oh, got it. Change that velocity to 1. All right, now we'll play. All right. So we can see that our position graph is increasing, straight line, up. Our velocity graph is a horizontal constant line with a value of 1. We're going to stop him before he hits the wall. Although I'm kind of curious what's going to happen if I don't stop him. Let's see. All right, once he hits the wall, it just his position just remains constant. Not super exciting. All right, so we go back here. We're just going to gr draw the graphs. So I would draw a graph that went from like 0 to 10. We got about 10 seconds on the x-axis, 0 to 10 on the y-axis, and just a straight line, just on an angle upwards with a constant slope. And the velocity is going to be just a horizontal graph at a y value of 1. And then we're going to reset everything. And we're going to do 1.5 meters per second. So we'll go here. I'm just going to type it in and hit play. So he's moving faster slightly and you can see that the slope of this line has increased it's gotten a little steeper this is still a horizontal line at a value of 1.5 and acceleration is still zero so you're just going to graph these out change the velocities and then answer these questions here you're going to set his velocity to 2.5 and then you're going to answer more questions Find a way to make the man move to the left. Well, what do you think? If we want his position to get in the negative direction, what if we give him a negative velocity? Let's see. Look at that. Now he's in the negative. Sorry if I gave it away there. All right. And I think that's... And then we have some questions at the, at the end, and we're good.